Argentum, Atomic Number 47, The Grey Metal. Whichever name you prefer, silver is widely regarded as one of the world's most versatile precious metals. Many people view silver demand through the lens of bars and coins or jewelry. But over 50% of the demand is for global industrial and technology use. This is because of its outstanding thermal and electrical conductivity, making it a key tool for industrial growth. In 2015, worldwide silver mine production increased for a 13th consecutive year to a record high of 886.7 million ounces. Notable country level increases included Peru, Argentina, Russia and India. Silver's varied applications can help support its price when growth cycles in one industry are weaker than in others. It's also closely correlated to the economic business cycle and industrial demand. About 72% of demand comes from cyclical sectors like industry and technology, including the usage in solar panels. This positions silver to benefit from the drive to energy efficiency. Jewelry, retail bar, and coin purchases are additional sales drivers. Silver is likely to be a beneficiary of continuing loose monetary policy as investors seek hard assets that cannot be debased. With a correlation of around 80% to gold, silver rides on the yellow metal's coattails, usually moving in the same direction but making larger movements in both directions. Silver is a risk management tool since it helps diversify equity exposure and equity risk. It's also a proven hedge against event and tail risk. Like gold, silver acts as a quasi-currency. As a hard asset, silver can be effective as a store of value by preserving purchasing power.